we're here once again to open a, another Hot Toys. This is the Deluxe Edition Baba Ga. <laughs> this is actually Black Adam from the Black Adam movie uh, Golden Armor Deluxe. So, like all Hot Toys, inside the shipper box, it's wrapped in plastic. So, this is the Golden Armor. This is the um, like I said, it's quite cold. I actually had to tilt the camera up. So, let's see how to open this up. So I guess you have to pull this out. This, this is totally different than other hot toys. So this is the back of the armor. It comes with this cover, it protects the whole thing. It reminds me of the DX uh, version of the Dark Knight. And the VS, Black Adam. So it comes with an instruction manual that you won't even bother opening it up. We have this huge base, really nice diorama, Black Adam, really have a strong smell of plastic, backside, really nice looking diorama, comes with a bunch of you know, um, lightning or light effect. This is like a dome one, kind of rounded. And there's another one you can attach to his arm. And another one here. And there's also this like lightning rod. Make him hold it. And another one with those lightning thing that he can hold. Two more. His chest should have a light of feature, so I believe this is like the light part or the battery pack. this and of course extra pegs in case you break one or two and some gadgets of course uh, I believe this for the eye flexible you know, stand to attach to his hip Talk about how many extra set of hands we have. Big, big hands. So the left one has this armor on it. And then another set of hands. Let's see the difference. One is open, the other one and a little bit close, semi-close. And to grab onto something, probably one of the lightning. One is kind of raised eyebrow. So this uh, rolling eye. And move the eye, make him look sideways by moving those. You can see that, yeah. And here's Black Adam. Let's compare the two heads. One is just a regular expression, there's really not much difference. 
This is just made him look a little bit angrier with an open mouth. This two head is almost the same with just a little bit of raised eyebrow. So I guess you can unscrew this one and put the battery on here. It might be wrong, but I don't want to open it up. So it would light up the eyes as well. So this goes all the way in here. There we go. You can still pull the head. If you just want to change the head. As you can see, it should reflect as well. To light up the eyes. I love this. Good thing about this, this is wired. So it can be displayed uh, with you know, dramatic features. I don't like this hands that are on him. I think I'll change that to something else. All you need to do is pull that out. And probably this hand here. I'll use this hand here. That's way better. More expressive. So in terms of, so this is soft, I guess because of the light in it, and the whole body is soft, you can really feel the rubber on it. This one is hard, so this would be like just a plastic that goes around the body. This is like a body suit. Uh, I'm afraid this probably, you know, would rip if you pose it. So I'll just keep it in the same pose. But you can stretch it out. Mm, I want to damage it. But you can hear the ratchet. That's kind of different. And the elbow, kind of awkward looking elbow here. This gap here. When he's looking, uh, what do you call this? Uh, arm piece here. Uh, it's a look of you know, belt wrapped around the arm, forearm. He has this thing here, his biceps, this armor here. This is the golden armor because uh, towards the end he you know, changed his suit to a golden part. And the belt here. He also has this coming out here on the belt. Uh, no, no torso movement. And leg. I don't even want to try and swing it. Kind of restricted, actually. But I, I, maybe you can move it, but I don't even want to bother it. Bother doing so. I don't want to damage the figure. So, this can be bent. So, I'm really not sure of the material use for this. Kind of different texture. Anyway, the boots can um, kind of restrict the movement. Um, for the ankle, yeah, you can move it a bit. Let's see, you can't even twist it. So I guess very limited movement for this figure. But really nice looking figure though. So on his stand, 
it actually does look good on this stand I'll take some pictures of it anyway thanks for watching like share and subscribe if you like the video and feel free to watch my other videos thank you